Recording in progress. We're ready now. Thank you. Okay, so hi, it's on. Um, hi. Now, thank you for accommodating this interview. You know, we're, we're from the Philippines, and you know, the Premier League is pretty huge here you know, in terms of viewership. You know, it's a small country, but you know, we're pretty much you know all, all of us are a football country. So, you know, um, you know, it's quite an honor to have you here, and um, my colleague Rick. Rick you know, we'll uh, ask you a few questions. So just take about 10 minutes. Is that okay? Okay. All right. Thank you very much. So I will cut my audio and video and I'll come back later. Hi, Anson. Good evening. Uh, good afternoon yeah. there. It's evening afternoon. here in Manila. I hope that you're fine. Congratulations on your last win. Thank you. Uh, we just have a few questions. Um, you've played, of course, in your native country of France. You've played in Scotland and England now. What's it like playing in the English Premier League? Is it uh, as exciting and as dynamic as what people tell you? Talk about playing for, in England in the Premier League and for Crystal Palace. Uh, playing in England it was, is very different from uh, playing in France or Scotland. I think uh, there's the best league in the world. So. It's more difficult, it's more intense, it's more technique, and uh, we have to give 100% every game. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, while you were playing for your Celtic, Brendan Rodgers said you were a top striker. With six goals for Palace so far, how has been the transition to the English Premier League? Uh, the transition was hard at the beginning because uh, it's always difficult to, to change to change the team, to change uh, the change the city, but mm -hmm. um, I think uh, I done well, and um, all the player and the staff helped me to settle uh, in the new team, so it's good. Right, you've played for some iconic managers in Laurent Blanc, and uh, now with Bre with Brendan, of course, and now you got Patrick Vieira uh, with Crystal Palace. Talk about the opportunity of playing for such an all-time football great in Patrick Vieira? It's a very good opportunity for me because uh, he's a big legend. Also, he's a great manager. Uh -huh. I saw his team uh, in East playing well, playing uh, some good football. So uh -huh. when he talked to me for come to Palace, I don't hesitate and I come straight. I know I can progress with him and uh, we can play uh, some good football. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just a few more questions, so Odson. It's been, an, you know, when Crystal Palace started the season, you looked very good, you were well organized. I'm not saying that you're not well organized anymore. Um, but it's been an up and down roller coaster ride of a season. Um, what do you think? Um, where do you see? Where do you see the Eagles finishing? Where do you see Crystal Palace finishing this season? And uh, after that, talk about the upcoming match against Burnley. We just take uh, game after game and uh, we try to win every game as possible. And uh, I hope we finish the, the highest position we can. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, just our last question for this one. Uh, what? what the last game was huge. That was a huge result, and um, hopefully it will it will push Crystal Palace towards a really good run and make a good run, get back into the top ten, and all that. Um, what did your manager tell all of you after that game? And you know, you're up against Burnley. You know, Burnley's not they're a tough foe. They're they're organized defensively. And uh, what did your manager tell you with uh, after that match against Watford, that win, and um, what to expect from Burnley? After the game, he was very happy because uh, we play well and uh, we win the game. But after he know the the game against Burnley, he coming soon, he coming quickly, and uh, we have to recover and um, we have to be ready for this game because uh, it's a hard game, but it's a hard game to win. Sorry, there's one more question. What are the personal goals you have set for yourself this season with Crystal Palace? What do you hope to achieve 
Do you hope to be a regular first team member? What are your personal goals, Odson? My personal is uh, try to help the team with my quality. And uh, I don't have a personal objective, but a collective one is to to try to win uh, the most of the game and uh, finish the highest as possible. All right. Um, we hope you don't mind. We'd like you to invite all, because as Rally said earlier, the Premier, uh, the, the Premier League is huge here in the Philippines. We'd like you to invite Filipino fans to support Crystal Palace, if you can kindly just invite them. Like, say something like, hello to the Filipino football fans, watch Crystal Palace, you know, support us, something like that. Filipino. Do you want to let down the camera? Yeah. Yes. Filipino. Yeah. Hi, Filipino fans. Um, come on, um, make sure you watch Palace in the Premier League. Just down the camera. Harriet, there's something in the chat. Uh, Rally wrote it so he can read it. It's on the chat. Good. So, hello, Philippines. This is Odson Edward. Watch me and Crystal Palace on Premier League football. Yeah? Yep, that's yeah. it. Wonderful. Hi, Philippines um, fans. Premier football, player. Premier football. That's our channel. Premier football. Okay, fine. So you say, hello, uh, Phil hello, Philippines. This is Odson Edward. Watch me and Crystal Palace on Premier football. Okay. Football. Hello, Philippine fans. It's Odson Edward. Watch me and Crystal Palace in the Premier League. Is that okay? Awesome. Yeah. Really? Good? Great, that's great. Is it okay if we have a, have a picture taken, the three of us? Is that fine? Yeah. How do you want to take a picture? <laughs> we'll, yeah. just, we'll just do a screenshot from the computer. You can just get an airplane. Okay, you just going to do a screenshot. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Okay. All right. Okay, one, two.